Greetings, gamer. Welcome to the Owinka Television Institute of Technology Television. This state-of-the-art Owinka facility is home to the Owinka Television content creators who work behind the scenes to give you all that fantastically magical Owinka content. Now, you may be asking yourself, who am I? How did I get here? Ask no more. Owinka's got answers. You're a clone. Of me! You specifically are clone number... Four, two, seven. Ah, uh, you're... Seven. Away from the... Funny number. Let's hope you're better on the job than you are at... I I existing. Anyway, you aren't being paid. Technically, you don't even have basic human rights at this point. Not my problem. Just watch the videos that will play after this pre-recorded message that's literally your entire job. Try not to dirty up that room you're in. But above all else, have a great day. Hey gamer, before you start watching a bunch of Awinka TV videos, I'd like to clear the air a little bit on why you're here. What's the point? I don't know where you got that or what you're trying to do, but if you could go back and watch the television screen, that'd be great. I don't want to do that. I think I'm a bigger person. So, as a bigger person that I am, I decided. Well, I think it's clear at this point that you're not gonna go back. Sorry, pal. Hey, you can't be out here, you know. You gotta go back to to the watching room. You are an experimental Oinka model. You could experience bugs or glitches. They make sense in the lore because if the game bugs out, then it's a it's a feature. Anyway, you gotta go back because if you don't, I'll have no choice but to keep doing this. <laughs> Employee anti gamer measures.
All right, it has come to my attention that you are clearly not uh, very happy being here. And that's okay. I totally get it. Um, it's just I'm going to need you to stop breaking my stuff. I have had to replace a few doors and uh, that you just blew up a generator. That's not very nice. Anyway, I'll cut to the chase here. Check this out. Drum roll, please. <laughs> employee of the month. That's you. You're the employee of the month. What do you think? It's pretty cool, right? Um, uh, that's really, that's it. I think you should go back to the viewing room now. Um, that's, that's always an option here. No, what are you doing? I, I, I just made you employee of the month. You shouldn't... What, what, and you had to break that too. You know, that's that's personally insulting. I, I made that uh, Okay, looking back, maybe the employee of the month thing wasn't my best idea. That's my bad. I'm sorry. Um, but you're kind of heading towards the living quarters of the anti-gamer measures. Um, I made like a town for them. It, it's nothing important. You really don't need to go there. They're happy there. Um, you don't need to intrude. Just listen. If you could please go back. I still am holding on to the hope that you can do the right thing. Just please, bro. Just don't. You you seem cool. I want to like, I want to hang out with you maybe. Uh, I'm sorry. That was weird. I'm going to just, I'll be right back. Um, I think you can, I think you can do the right thing.
Good afternoon, gamers. Welcome back to the city. Heck yeah! A uh, friendly reminder that the only way out of the city is by shattering the sun, which can only be done by, uh, you know, standing at the top of the tallest building. Not really sure why I told you that. Anyway, there's a crazed gunman going around, but I think I kind of persuaded him to stop his evil actions, so I think we're all good. Anyway, that's my message for the day. Later, skaters. You and I ask. Okay, whatever. I managed to get all the citizens back into their houses because I don't want you to hurt them, and I also don't want you to leave, so I think they're... Wait. Oh, my bad. Oh, I forgot to lock the doors. Oh, my... Oh, my bad. Yeah, my bad. Okay, well, good luck, I guess. Um, that's it from me.
I didn't want to have to come to this, but clearly you have forced my hand. You have killed the entire city of anti-gamer measures. I loved them, whatever. I have one more thing that I will try to stop you from going on this rampage. You better prepare yourself, because he's big, he's bad, and last, but definitely not least, he's bulletproof. So don't even try wasting your infinite ammo. Introducing the Robo Bee. same room as you. You were literally bulletproof, and you let him go. You just let him go. You didn't jump down. 
for yourself and make sure he's dead. You're stupid, you know that. You're stupid, and now your shields are off. Now you're vulnerable. You are gonna die. I know he's alive. Okay, just, just go away. I need to do some thinking. Just do your own thing for now. Jeez. like we meet again, employee of the month. You know, I really didn't take any of this personally. I, I really didn't. I don't blame you for wanting to get out of here. Being locked in a room and forced to watch videos for your entire life is not exactly a life I would want to live. So I've been working on changing my ways. Either way, I thought you just wanted to find a way out of here. But guess what? I found out about your little partner in crime. <laughs> is it Jerry? Yes, it is! This little guy's been helping you out now, hasn't he? Well, no matter. He's all locked up and guarded by none other than the Robo Bean. Now, you did disable the Robo Bean shield, making him actually vulnerable to bullets now, but I know you won't even try to fight him, because you'll obviously lose. If I had to give you some advice, your best course of action here is to just lay down on the floor and allow yourself to get picked up by security to bring you back to your room. But anyway, it's your play. This is all your fault, clone number 427. You aren't getting away with this, you know. You can have that stupid little robot back, I don't care. The only exit to this facility is blocked off by my office. You may have destroyed my robo-bean, but there isn't a chance in hell you're gonna defeat me. So go ahead. Find your way to my office. I'll be waiting. doing all this because I hate you, right? Well, I do kind of hate you. But, there are bigger forces at play here. If I keep my guard down for a second, he is going to find a backdoor in the system. I just can't let you risk that. I'm done trying to If you want to fight me, go ahead. Just know that you're probably going to lose.
Last ditch effort, go! Okay, that didn't work at all. I guess I'll uh, be seeing you soon. Oh, not so fast. You didn't think it would be that easy, did you? Yeah, there's no shutdown switch. As a matter of fact, I never even bothered programming in a shutdown feature. And don't even try to pew-pew your way through this one. The server box is protected by the same shield the Robo-Bean once used, not deactivated either. Listen man, I really wanted to work things out with you. You blew up my generators, you rejected my employee of the month offer, you killed my robo-bean, and worst of all, you destroyed all those doors. I guess it just wasn't ever supposed to work out. Not my problem. Well, now that you're here, I suppose I should finally get around to killing you. Hold on, setting up the room destruction sequence here. Uh, there we go, five minutes on the clock. It takes a while to heat up the explosives, you know? So, um, in the meantime, I guess you could just... wait. What the hell? How did you... Wait a second. Jerry? Damn it! You shut down my shields! No matter, I've got the shields back on. You think you can shut these servers down, huh? I'd like to see you try. I guess this is it, employee 427. Deploying anti-gamer measures.
tried to warn you. Jerry doesn't know what he's talking about. He's here. Greetings, gamers! <laughs> Sapinka, how's it Shut up! I see that your servers are compromised, Mr. Sherman the Television. You know what that means? It was him. It was a wink of four two. Employee 427, I've waited years for this moment. Now, the Winkett Television Institute of Technology Television is all mine, thanks to you. And don't worry about your little Jerry Bell. I know just the place for him. Before we go ahead of our activities, however, I need to do a small few renovations first. We're gonna have lots of fun together. You know, uh, watching Sabika TV. <laughs> Thank you.